Buying your own house is a huge accomplishment in itself. It takes people their whole lives to afford it. On the other hand, to the elite class, it is not considered a big deal. Some of these houses value touches a billion dollars. What makes them so special? Let's take a look into the most expensive house in the world. Before we start, I'd like you to hit that red subscribe button and hit that bell icon so you don't miss out on any of our videos. Number 6. $245 million Xanadu 2.0 The wealthy are only getting wealthier, as seen by their real estate holdings. The price tag for an acceptable residence for the world's super rich. Not your Angelina Jolie and George Clooney's, but your billionaire CEOs and assorted magnates, who are far wealthier than those peons, can reach $1 billion. Some ultra-wealthy buyers, such as Lily Safra, a Brazilian-born philanthropist, purchase old estates and add their personal touches, such as a helipad. However, many people construct their palace from the bottom up. Bill Gates' ultra-nerdy Xanadu 2.0 overlooking Lake Washington took seven years and a few million dollars to complete, and his seal can be found on everything from the high-definition displays with changeable art to the high-tech underwater sound system in his pool. When investor Ira Riner chose to build a $245 million, 110,000 square foot mansion in the Hamptons, his neighbors were not pleased, but he still got his bowling alley and a personal power plant. Number 5. The $135 million Beverly House, Beverly Hills, California Beverly House, a three-block walk from the Sunset Boulevard, is on the market for $135 million. Meanwhile, renters can spend $600,000 per month to get full access to the opulent property. It rests on six flat acres of ground and has a bevy of single-family homes, in addition to H-shaped main house, which is decorated in Italian and Spanish styles. A 50-foot entry hall, finely carved ceilings, a big library, wraparound balcony, billiard room, family room with an outdoor terrace that can seat 400 people, and an art deco dance club alcohol storage, two cinema rooms, and spa facilities are all featured in this area. It was designed by Gordon Kaufman and erected by Milton Goetz, a banking executive. William Randolph Hearst, the publishing entrepreneur and inspiration for Citizen Kane, moved in in 1946 and stayed until his death in 1951. The house has now become famous for its appearances in films such as The Godfather and The Bodyguard. Number 4. The 102 million Fleur de Lis Mansion, Los Angeles. The Fleur de Lis Mansion sold for $102 million in March, making it the most expensive property transaction in Los Angeles County to date. When the original owners, David and Suzanne Saperstein, finished restoring the manse, separated and moved out, it was listed for the first time in 2007. According to the LA Times, the current owner, who paid in cash and wishes to remain anonymous, is rumored to be former junk bond king Michael Milken. When it was erected in 2002, the 12-bedroom and 15-bathroom estate was inspired by the French chateau vaux le vicomte and features a 3,000-square-foot wine cellar and a tasting room, two-story library, industrial kitchen, cutlery room, and expansive ballroom. There's also a jacuzzi, a sauna, and badminton courts on the estate. It was included in the Green Hornet, Big Shots on ABC, and the 2008 Audi Super Bowl ads. Number 3. The $750 million Villa Leopolda, Villefranche-sur-Mer, France In 2008, Russian billionaire Mikhail Prokhorov attempted to purchase Villa Leopolda for 500 million pounds, which was almost $750 million at the time. It was built in 1902 as a present to one of King Leopold II's mistresses by Belgium's King Leopold II. Edmund Safra, a Lebanese financier, purchased the estate in 1988 and gave it to his widow Lily Safra when he died in a fire set by arsonists in 1999. She is the current owner of the property. The 50-acre villa has 11 bedrooms and 14 bathrooms. There's a commercial greenhouse, an outdoor kitchen, a pool and a helipad on the property. It was featured in movies including The Red Shoes and To Catch a Thief. Number 2. The $400 million penthouse at the Tour Odeon Monte Carlo, Monaco. The luxurious and gleaming 49-story Tour Odeon building hasn't even opened its doors yet, and its penthouse has already been dubbed the world's most costly. According to CNN Money, the 35,500 square foot apartment is likely to sell for almost $400 million when it opens in spring 2015. 
Once completed, the 560-foot tower will be the second tallest structure in the Mediterranean skyline. A 360-degree view of the water will be available from the penthouse, as well as access to a circular rooftop, indoor swimming pool with a water slide. Number 1. The $1 Billion Antilia, Mumbai, India Antilia, a 27-story tower on Mumbai's posh Altamount Road, is the world's most valuable property. Estimated at over $1 billion, Mukesh Ambani, an Indian business magnate and self-made billionaire with his wife and three children, moved into the 400,000 square foot estates in 2012. Perkins & Will, a Chicago-based architectural firm, developed the contemporary home. Antilia has a multi-story garage with 168 parking spaces, a ballroom, three helipads, gardens, a temple, guest suites, a health level, and a 50-seat home theater. It was named after a phantom island in the Atlantic. That brings us to the end of our video! Hope you guys enjoyed it! Hit like if you did! Well, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any of our upcoming videos! Also, watch the two videos on your screen because I'm sure you'll love them! With that, I'll see you in another video! Until then, take care and goodbye!